Hi, today I'll be showing you an easy method for locating the correct driver to install for your computer. Oftentimes when you do a clean install of Windows 7 or Windows 8 or something like that, if you look in Device Manager you actually have some missing drivers. Some of them might have a name, other ones might actually be listed as an unknown device. And so it can be sort of difficult to find out exactly what you need to install. And going to your computer manufacturer's website might not always allow you to download and install the correct drivers. So using this method, you'll actually be able to Google the device and find its name, and then that'll lead you to the correct installation website. So to begin, we're going to open up Device Manager. So you can open up the Start menu by hitting the Windows key on your computer. And then on the right side here, we'll right-click on Computer and go into Properties. And then on the left, we'll open up Device Manager. This does require administrator rights to have full access, so if you're on a standard account, you'll get a warning like this. So on this computer, I already have all of my drivers installed, but if you are on a computer that is missing some, the menus for those particular drivers will be expanded. So we'll use this um, ATI Mobility Radon HD 4650 as an example. If the correct driver wasn't already installed, it might be listed as just a generic graphics driver or it could be even listed as an unknown device. So how do we go about locating the correct driver? What you want to do is find that device, right click on it, and then go into properties. From here you'll want to go to the details tab and then under the property section switch from device description to hardware IDs. This value will contain the information about the vendor as well as the device. And you can actually right click on it and do a copy. And now we'll open up our browser and go into a search engine such as Google and just search on that term. So I'm just going to paste it into the search bar in Chrome, the full device ID there. And I get a list of results that are going to actually match my device. I'll click on the first result and right at the top it's going to tell me the name of the device. You'll see that that matches the name of the device that I already have installed which means that it's good information. Now I wouldn't necessarily trust this website and download straight from it but armed with the information of the name of the device I can now actually Google this device and add driver to the end of the search term and get the correct driver directly from AMD or Dell or whoever the manufacturer is. So there you go. Use the hardware device ID for any missing drivers to help you find out exactly what you're missing and get to the best website to download them.